This is the wax melter's filling system control panel. Tell your melter on, off, the filler heat on, off, melter temp, heating temp, the speeds for your recipes, whether it's scent separately pumped in, color separately pumped in, and then the dispensing speed for your timer. It'll keep track of how much wax is in your tank, your preset counts, and simply you have recipes. Here we just set preset six recipes and uh, cinnamon tropical rain. Each recipe on the touch screen when you touch them you can see it has the melt point that you need and you can go further on the, the temperatures uh, for the pump, the heaters and everything else and then it has times, how many jars you like to do um, whether you're doing a few ounces, you know, tea lights, three ounce, four ounce, eight ounce. You just set everything you need. So then you just pick your recipe, whichever one it is. So you want to do blueberry. You click load. So then it fills in the blueberry, loads it up. Everything's set now to run your blueberry. Uh, you count everything else that you need preset. This one's not preset. So we're going to count, make it 50 that we're going to use. And as it fills, it's going to keep counting. Temperature, you can, let's say you need to calibrate it for any reason. You lower it, raise it, or you hit the dial, and there you go, you have a, you have a full keypad. So if you just want to do it that way. So, and then same thing with the percentages that you need to control here. So let's say we're done with those candles, then we want to make our orange blossom candles. There you go. And on this one here, then you can go over and specify if it's going to be a tea light or if it's going to be a 4 ounce, 45 ounce, whatever size you're doing. You load it up, you hit enter. And now here you go. Now you have your orange set up. If you need to edit a recipe, let's say you've been using your rainforest and you have a different supplier now, you need to tweak it, just hit edit, and then you can edit all your settings. You can adjust the, how you want to do it. And then again, then you can just go right through your recipes and tweak whatever else you need to tweak percentage-wise. And that's it.